I said, I'm going to do your reading. I said, oh, they probably need to uh, have a reading, a message right now. First card is strongest. It's your card. What are you thinking? What are you thinking about? I should have known, right? <laughs> Two of Cups. What else I would be thinking, Sal? The person that I love. Okay, we'll go there. Virgo. Let's see. This morning in my free consultation on our app, I message everyone about experiencing some sort of delay um, in life, whatever it may be. Delay in marriage, relationship, money, you know. And I gave them an advice about how to use uh, Super 7, okay, which I can talk more about later. But you can download our app for free and, you know, have a ball. It's free uh, for Apple and Android. And I give out my messages there. Oh, turn on the notification, okay? You have the Hermit and the Two of Cups. Uh, there's something about love that you have this ideology and you found it, but then it wasn't how you have pictured it. Hmm. The Hermit seeks for an answer, you know, with God and you've been praying consistently also manifesting the love of your life, the Two of Cups. So, the person came into your life, but then you ask God again, is this the one? <laughs> this is giving, like, a having cold feet in a relationship where you just have some sort of doubt. It could be a day of doubt, you know. We all get, we get to things in, like, you know, sometimes, oh, there's no doubt, they say. Temperance is here. Mm. So, we the Two of Cups and the Temperance, what I'm seeing here is you want this relationship to manifest, which only means you're single and you feel alone. Or you're not single, you're with someone, but you just don't know if they love you or care about you or this. So there's something about actions. They're not showing up as someone who is reaffirming you with their love or their care. That's why you ask with the hermit. Temperance is here though. You're trying to make it work. Mm -hmm. You're trying to make it work because you love them. Mm -hmm. So from what I'm seeing here with the temperance and the two of cups, I'm seeing that your challenge to it's like your challenge to make it happen, your challenge to make it work, something like that. Nine of Cups to the Five Pentacles. It could be like they're not supporting you financially and you need the finances, meaning it's like, I'm the only one, Sal. Breadwinner, mm -hmm. right? Me, I'm a bread, I'm a bread eater in the family, not the winner. <laughs> I'm kidding. So, Nine of Cups with the Five of Pentacles, empty. No contact, no communication, right? Or this is just how you feel. You'd be with them in the living room or in the bed or you guys are going out on a date. And you just know deep within you that there's something lacking. And people, you know, if people were just honest and real, they don't always, meaning love is always there probably, yes. But there are times where you don't feel it to your partner, you know. They didn't leave the toilet seat, Sal, so, you know. You don't feel the love anymore. <laughs> they didn't throw out the trash. <laughs> now, it's not like what they do. I feel like you are somewhat, you know, because when I did the Libra reading, it was blah. And this is what you're feeling right now. Five of Pentacles. Used to be probably happy, ecstatic, you know, and that's why the young, you know, the young couples, you know, they're excited to see the world and experience life together. But that has its own limit. You know, what happens if your person cannot be there there you know and then you want to be there and the other place other person wants to be something and then now there's something missing you guys met you know to have fun to have cups right but then life gets serious and this is what i feel like you want from them now is like for things to be serious four of cups and the knight of swords okay so i see your frustration your frustration is coming in with how they communicate to you. 
So, the Knight of Swords, the Four of Cups, okay, is here where there is some sort of harshness when they're not in the mood or not in the mood. So they can be very grumpy and moody. They're not always the best person to be around, which is like anyone in the world, they will have their moments, right? Like, I'm, I'm not, well, I, I'm a type of person because if you're inside a room, I try to match the energy. So if you're happy, you're happy. If you're sad, I'm sad too. So it's all, I don't go the opposite. Yeah, you yeah, understand? So it's like I just go with the flow. So I'm not sure what well, your person goes the opposite. Well, one, because I know astrology, so I don't go opposite. The opposite can be tough. Yeah, you now. And I can be very tough. But your person is very much tough. Like you want happy, they can be not like, well, I'm not, I'm not in the mood today. You know, so there's not even consideration for your feelings, right? And that's the Knight of Swords, the harshness you feel that. It's like I'll be totally excited, and they won't. I'll be not. I'll be needing their support, and then the only thing I get is just rude, night of swords, and harshness. Business, the house, the car, and of course the relationship. So if you're stuck and you don't know what's going to happen in your 2024, turn it around today. Get your citrine and obsidian. Our website is eatreadlove.me. So you get into this connection, right? And now you feel stuck, you know, suffering in silence. Five Pentacles. You haven't aired out. I feel like you have this way of uh, faking it. Like, oh, never it's fine. It's good, it's good, yeah. But deeper that within your five pentacles is there now, meaning emptiness. Now, when I was teaching, ooh, two of ones are wondering, will of fortune and how things to move forward. When I was teaching this morning in our app, um, the Super 7, which is available now, this is the Black Obsidian and Citrine with the Laughing Buddha, all Thai right here. Um, it brings joy, and you know when we know when we're in our joyous moment or energy, we attract more good things in our life. You know, so I wear this together with my double PO, and the Super Seven is there. This is available now on our website. We just launched this, and we do ship to more than eighty countries across the globe. There's four kinds, and you know whichever you see fit for you. But every bracelet has a Super Seven. Super Seven has seven crystals inside it. And I put one there because that's how strong it is. And, you know, it helps you manifest different things all at the same time. So one crystal to rule them all. And love, money, relationship, healing, you know, or you want travel, you want your dreams, you want your career. So that's where the Super 7 comes in. Oh, it's very, very strong. So you can check it out now. Okay. So with the Two of Wands, and then you have the Wheel of Fortune here, nothing is impossible. So I like that whole energy and vibe. You still manage, uh, you're not like, oh, I think it was a Sag who was definitely a slump right now. You know, you're finding the good still, okay? You're, you may be challenged if you're like, oh, no, it's never going to be. But the Wheel of Fortune, like things are about to go to your favor, right? The Wheel of Fortune is taking a chance on Lady Luck. Fate, you know, you have full faith in this situation that it's going to get better, which is the Wheel of Fortune. And you're just waiting for it because this is wonderful time unfortunately i don't have enough time today because i gotta go and start making the bracelets that you guys have ordered tomorrow we'll touch a subject again visit our website eatreadlove.me hope you guys have a wonderful day